<laughs> you like that? Chuck. I see you there, Chuck. So we've had this place uh, coming up seven years. That one of the things that we definitely did right, and I suppose for that reason, one of the things I could recommend anybody who has just bought a uh, a small holding to do would be to plant trees as soon as you can. Um, not necessarily in the ultimate spot that you think those trees might so go. So that you have a bank of trees that put on some growth and acclimatize to your particular location such that you then have and can use this bank of trees to plant out when you're ready. I think this has been a very good idea, this, this sort of general approach of um, planting trees <clears throat> in a protected area as soon as we were able to, so very shortly after we bought the property. Um, and even if the trees don't ultimately remain where we first put them, what this area has is done give us a bank of trees uh, which have good growth, so they, they would be expensive to buy now, um, but more importantly they're acclimatised to our particular area. Now they'll get a bit of a setback when they're dug up and moved, um, and to some degree there'll be a slightly different microclimate down the front um, compared to what there is here, but in general terms I think this has worked really well. Um, like that, I mean, there's no no chance that we could buy a plum tree of that size and 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 put it here now. Uh, and this literally was just a tiny little thing. If you go back and see very early videos that I put on YouTube, you'll probably see this tree and indeed most of them in here. Um, a lot of these trees literally came in the post, uh, so were were collected uh, from a mailbox domestic mailbox, uh, which indicates just how little they were. <laughs>